beloved of God, I'm Bishop Larry Kokendorfer. And as we begin this season of Lent, I bring you greetings from your siblings in Christ here at the Synod office, from those at Trinity Lutheran in Whitehorse, from St. Peter's and Unity Lutheran in Medicine Hat, and all the congregations and specialized ministries in between. I invite you this Lenten season to a time of baptismal remembrance, remembering that we were washed in the water and in the word of our baptism. And as we journey this Lenten season, remembering that God is merciful and just, slow to anger and filled with steadfast love. So I invite you into this time of baptismal remembrance. Blessed be the whole Trinity, one God, the fountain of living water, the rock who gave us birth, our light and our salvation. Amen. Joined to Christ in the waters of baptism, we are clothed with God's mercy and forgiveness. Let us give thanks for the gift of baptism. We give you thanks, O God, for in the beginning your spirit moved over the waters, and by your word you created the world, calling forth life in which you took delight. Through the waters of the flood you delivered Noah and his family. Through the sea you led your people Israel from slavery into freedom. At the river your son was baptized by John and anointed with the Holy Spirit. By water and your word, you claim us as daughters and sons, making us heirs of your promise and servants of all. We praise you for the gift of water that sustains life. And above all, we praise you for the gift of life, in, of new life in Jesus Christ. Shower us with your spirit and renew our lives with your forgiveness, grace, and love. To you be given honor and praise through Jesus Christ, our Lord in the unity of the Holy Spirit, now and forever. Amen. Beloved of God, as you journey this Lenten season, the God of steadfastness and encouragement grants you to live in harmony with one another in accordance with Christ Jesus. Amen. And the God of hope fill you with all joy and peace in believing so that you may abound in hope by the power of the Holy Spirit. Amen. And the God of all grace bless you now and forever. Amen. 